Yeah, hello and welcome to this video playing Maret uh, 2. <coughs> Sorry, Maret 2. Okay, I'm going to. Oops, hey, it's giving me a piece. Hooray. The sad news is, I mean, this is this, this line is just bad for white, but I haven't looked looked at it <laughs> yet. So um, I only know that it is terrible, but I don't really know why. Terrible is strong, but it's it's just it's just incorrect. Yeah, it's an incorrect way of playing. So um, bishop c five. I have the much better development here. Okay. What are you doing here, Maret? Where is he castling, for example? <laughs> um, okay. The question is, I mean, I can simply, I should probably at one point retrieve the king from e6. I'm doing this now. Let's go all the way back to g8. That's just simpler to play. Yeah, knight h5 is something that comes into consideration. But um, so, so nothing wrong with simply centralizing, like with queen to d7, rook d8. Maybe he wants to wants to play bishop e3 here or I don't know. He is he has three pawns for this piece, but they don't really they don't really uh, work all that well together at the moment. Yeah, the knight will come to d5. I guess that is the that is the idea that he's got. We should do this. Bishop f6. Bishop takes c3. I don't want a knight coming to a d5. That would be quite disturbing. He tries to do it now in a different way. Okay. Ninety-five now, however, is is risky. I mean, knight g three here. It's very close. It's very close to working. With the, with the mating ideas on the h farm. There's also knight d3 in this position. Hmm. Going to go to e3. Hmm. Yeah, I'm so busy looking, finding a win that I'm probably losing on time. <sighs> Twenty-four seconds.
Yeah, I hope it. I hope um, I'm winning here. Yeah, otherwise, <laughs> I mean, I, I think I think I'm I'm fine, but it's a bit of an odd an odd position. It's good to have an increment, but 14 seconds is still not easy. Um, what is best here, actually? This? Not sure. Eleven seconds. Nah, this is covered. I'm such a moron. My God, no! I, losing this game eh, would be the worst. Yeah, what a ridiculous thing to do. Ah, and now I'm allowing to trade queens. I'm losing this game. Don't believe this shit. Sorry. What a ridiculous game to lose. Yeah, you're like winning from move five, yeah? Yeah. What a ridiculous game to lose. I just take E4, which is protected twice. Yes, that's a way to lose a game. It's great. How ridiculous. I mean, you can do... I'm a rook up. <laughs> yeah, okay, sorry for the rent, but I have to do it. Yeah, I mean, these are the kind of games that drive me nuts, yeah, really. Anyway, yeah, so, yeah, I know that this is basically uh, refuting the whole opening. Here, maybe d5, that's also what the engine gives, yeah. And the Cochrane Gambit is just crap. I mean, anything else would be too nice. Yeah, okay, well, I mean, I'm better here as well, of course, but it's not, it doesn't matter all that much yeah, if you if you give away a full rook at the end. Yeah, the piece is clearly stronger here than three pawns. And uh, I wouldn't really, I wouldn't be surprised if I had a mate because I mean, he's just going right into this mate mechanism with knight g3. And um, yeah. That actually does not work, yeah? but okay, I was really down and um, hoped to, to get the th get things settled. Yeah, knight c4 was of course not bad. I mean, that's a strategically good move because b4 was giving me that square for nothing. But um, okay, I was thinking that should win. But in fact, queen c1 is saving him. Queen c1, knight h4, knight f4. It's just about holding. Okay. Yeah, and after that, I'm just up up a ton of material. Yeah, c5, what is better? Knight h3 is still continuing. And now, okay. And I, mean, I give him a full rook in. <laughs> this is the, the story of the game. Um, giving, giving full rooks is not healthy. I don't know, I just had a complete... I was also thinking somehow it would take with the pawn, but okay, it took with the rook. And I still t took here, which was, which was my intended move after pawn takes. And I don't know why. Eh? Now it's of course dead lost with the C pawns. Okay, thanks a lot for watching.